Hey guys, what is up? Dave here coming back to you with a brand new video on the channel and you might be wondering what are we looking at here? This is Car X Street. Now you might remember, you know, maybe a week and a half, two weeks ago, I made a video about this game and said that, you know, it wasn't even playable on my computer, which was true. It wasn't. Uh, you guys saw the video. It was not a very long video. But with version 1.05 that released recently, it's very much playable, which is sick. Let's go into this car dealer real quick. I just want to check out, you know, what's available in the game overall. I want to see what these cars look like. So we got the Honda Civic. We got the Miata, which is the car I decided to start with. Yo, there's a little kitty cat. Okay, I'm a fan. I'm a sucker for kitty cats. I'm sorry. And orange cats, too. Like, orange cat behavior is just crazy. This is a sick little parking lot, though. I really like how this works. Just look at one car. It would be cool if there were some cars in the background just to be there, but, you know, not a big deal. Why am I Walter White? For my logo. Profile picture. I didn't set that. Another Mazda Miata. Sick. Ooh, man, there are some good-looking cars in this game. I will give them that. The game looks good, but, like, while you're driving around on the map, I've done a couple races already just to feel it out. It's a very strange visual experience. There's a lot of pop-in that's very strange. Where, like, you're driving along and the car doesn't show that, you know, the traffic cars just have no details to them until you're literally right on top of them. And it it's just really weird. There is a good selection of cars, but, man, is it very JDM-centric, man. Like, yeah, there's the other, there's the usual, but we're only in C2. Now we're in C3. There's there's a lot of cars in this game. Holy cow. Mustangs. RX-7s. Uh, hold on. Okay, so what's like the best car in the game? That. Got it. This GTR is nasty. That's sick. There are some cool looking cars in this game. I'll give them that. It looks good. Man. Oh, look at this. Oh, man. That looks so good. I just can't get over the kitty cat. I love little details like that in games. Man, that thing looks good. Wow. Pretty good. You know, that's enough of the car dealership, though. You kind of got an idea of what to expect out of this game as far as cars. But yeah, you see how, like... Is that one of those Volkswagen... Wagon vans? There was one of these that got, like... Became really well-known recently for drag racing. It had, I think, the... Five-cylinder turbo in it. And it was making something like a thousand horsepower. It was absolutely insane. Well, let's see where this wants me to go. Car handling in this game is a little bit weird. It's a little bit floaty, a little bit heavy. I don't know if I like it or not. Boost doesn't feel like it does anything. I'll say that. I can't really figure out what I'm supposed to do, like if there's a single player campaign. You see how just there's no detail to the back of that car? It was so weird. Same with that one. It just pops in. Like, I'm on high graphics settings, 60 FPS. My computer's a Ryzen 5 5600, the 3080 Ti Founders GPU. And overall, this game just... I don't know, it doesn't run well. No matter what. Where am I going? And how far away is it? I wonder how fast you go through that fuel. That's to the left on the map. Minimap. Like, how fast do you use a whole tank of gas? Is it realistic or is it kind of 
stupid. Is it gamified? I guess is the best way to say it. That's a word that I learned with my job now. Gamified versus, I guess, realism. I don't know. The game does look good. Like, it's a very big city. You can drive pretty much anywhere you can see, which is absolutely awesome. But overall, I just... There's a lot of weird little things. I think this is definitely going to be a game I play. I can't play it on mobile. It doesn't work on my phone, so I'm not worried about that. But other than that, this is a game I think I'll catch myself playing. If I can get the handling figured out a little bit and maybe make this car better. Let's see what this race is all about. Races do load very quickly, which is sick. Oh, this is just free drift. That's sick. So do they change the condition of the road or anything? Or is it just like... Good luck. I kind of wish I wouldn't have used a car with stock horsepower for this because it's not very good. Um, come on. Move. I don't think I'm winning this. They want me to get 700 points. Drifting in games like this is not something I've ever been good at. This is also a very small area. I can clutch kick with A. That's interesting. It's almost easier to clutch kick. I am not good at drifting. Holy cow. This is not something I'm good at. This is why I stick to drag racing games. Oh, I'm at... Almost enough points to consider myself good. R4. Not terrible. Yeah, this is difficult. I'll take fifth. I'm okay with that. I wasn't expecting myself to do well with it anyway. Ugh. That was weird. So I think there's like a mini map thing I can pull up, isn't there? Oh. Yeah. I guess not. Maybe not. Oh yeah, there is. And then I can... What does that do? That doesn't do anything. I don't get it. There's... You know, on one hand, I say games kind of handheld... Handhold... Too often these days, but on the other hand... I don't know. It... Sometimes tutorial stuff is needed. That's for sure. Like, look how floaty that is. It just slides. It doesn't even try to stop. It's... I don't know, there's just something weird with this game, man. Anyway, I think Car X Drift, or uh, Car X Drift, Car X Streets is a game I'll probably play. I don't know if I'll play it a lot. I'll definitely keep this on my computer. But in all honesty, uh, so far with what I've played, I'm going to give it some time and I'll maybe make a video in a month once I've played through it a bunch and, you know, can upgrade my car and stuff. Right now, though, eh, I don't like it so far. Not that much. I would much rather go play, like, a Flash game, 1320 Challenge. Anyway, I'll talk to you guys later. Peace out.